Hello and welcome to another episode of Daily TV. Today we're going to be doing the Olimon Crystal Lab. So yeah, the Olimon Crystal Lab. We saw this in where did we see this? Home Centre, I think. Yeah, Home Centre. We were near Smiths and it was a shop near there. Because you like collecting your geodes and your stones. We'll have to do a little programme on that and show which ones you've got. But, yeah, this is an all-in-one crystal lab. Laboratoire le cristal de something or other. It's all in French. So, yeah, if we show you on the back, hidden amongst all the different languages, you've got the, uh, all the contents of uh, the box. So, and we... we've got a helper oh, that's today. your special helper visitor. Who is it? Applejack. <laughs> Apple Jack's helping us today. It's one of the min My Little Pony Equestria Girls minis which we showed you. You like those, don't you? Right, let's get this box open. And we found more of them. We found Pinkie Pie and... and, and we did, didn't we? We put them in... Oh, look, look at all this. We put it in the really toy hunt, didn't we? Right, so we've got Ooh, instructions. I sure they'll come in handy. Funny glasses. Goggles to protect your mince pies. <laughs> yeah! Do they work? Yeah, we've got a plastic mixing container, I think that is, another sort of mixing container, and then we've got these, these must be the, um, what we grow the crystals in, and that little pot. I've been asked to stuff. do yellow from, by my little brother, I've been asked to yellow. do yellow. Well, we're going to try and do all the colours, I think. We've got some Petri dishes, so these little uh, things, I've put the crystals in, I think, and make sure I've been able to And we've also got... Powder. Oh, these are the chemicals, which are impossible to open. Haha, <laughs> childproof locks, so you can't open it. As I say, push down and turn to open. Oh. Push down! <laughs> there we go. No, you can't open them, Isabella. And strangely enough, neither can I. Oh my goodness, oh there we go. Ooh. There's the crystals. It's basically, I think it's, what is it, aluminium sulfate or something. Let's have a look. I've heard of these before. So, all in one crystal lab experiment guide. This set contains chemicals and apparatus that may be harmful if misused. Mmm, missussed. Read cautions on individual containers carefully not to be used by children except under adult supervision. I'm going to super use my supervision and look at you. Right. I would say X-ray vision supervision, wouldn't you? Advice to supervising adults. Read the following instructions and safety rules for the first aid information and incorrect use of the chemical. Ba, 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 ba. Because children ah. so much that they supervise Look at me, Daddy. Ugh. <laughs> Crystals are classified into seven categories called crystal systems. So yeah, if you can make that out on there, you have better eyesight than me. There's a little focus, and there we go, so the different shapes of crystals. Let's see what we need then. So, first of all, we need, open a bottle of crystal chemicals, A, of the desired colour, and pour out one third bottle, or 15 grams, of the crystal growing chemical powder into the plastic cup. The rest of the chemical can be used as a seed, as seed crystals, for later use. Measure about 300 millilitres of warm tap water or distilled water for best results and pour it carefully into the plastic cup with the chemical. So right, so what we need then is warm water, first of all, so we need to get some of that. Mm -hmm. I think we have to do a jump cut and come back. Well we've just gone and got some warm water, because we didn't have any. Mono ammonium phosphate. Right. So what we need to do, you got your goggles on. Look at those crystals. Let's show everyone at home what that looks like. Yeah. We need the tweezers to see break it, but them up. There's sort of crystals already sort of formed in the bottom of there. Get it to focus. So millilitres. So that's going to be about that much. And then we've got to stir it all up. I think they're going to be what they call the seed crystals. Ready? Yes. Let's pour the liquid. Now we need to put the lid on. Like so. And then what we need to do is we need to put this somewhere safe. 
what we'll probably do is we'll have a go at doing some more of these in between videoing and however long it takes to do. It's not a quick thing. But um, we'll go and put this somewhere safe now. And then we might do some others, like I say, some of the blue ones and other colours. And then we'll catch up at the end of this video to show you what we got. So, some time has passed. Seconds to you, but it's been, I don't know, over a week or something for us. So we did that, we've left it for some time and we've had some crystals grow. Some have been really good, some not so good, haven't they? Not so good. No, so we've got our close-up cam and we've got our um, close -up crystals. Thing. We've got some petri dishes to put them in. And, and tweezers, tweezers so we can get, get the crystals out. out. So what I'm gonna do is, let's pick which one. We'll pick the one we did first, which was the yellow one, which was not very good. It's the first one we did, wasn't it? So you do that and I'll film some close-ups then, can I? Right, so then, let's have a look at what we've got in here. We've got some crystals down here by the looks of things, but nothing that special. These almost look like salt crystals. And we've got these little white crusty things here. And we've got in some of the others. But yeah, this, all the original stones, these things here are just the original sort of what they call seed stones we put in and sprinkled on, but they're not really what we're looking for, are they? Uh, I'll get one of the salt crystals. Got a salt crystal. No, let's have a look. Let's have a bit of a dig. I can see some of the ones that are crystals. Let's have a go. Down there. Let's see if we can. Oh, there what? we go. So we've got the whole thing there. Look, that's. So yeah, if we have a close up. Look, here's crystals. another little. We've got another one. Yeah, but they're not that special. If you can see here, look, there's just sort of some crystals that have grown in between the, the rocks and. Look at these. And these little white sort of crystal they're ones that are on the They're not crystally. Surf. No, they're not really, are they? Anyway, these ones aren't impressive, so I think we should move on to yeah. the other ones. So what's this one? Ooh. Oh. That one doesn't... It's not very good, is it? I can show you one here, actually. Look, it just looks like sort of coal almost, just sort of black. There's a little bit of sparky going on in there, but let's have a closer look. See if we can see anything interesting. It's all very dark in there, and yeah, not a lot happening really as far as crystals are concerned. I think that one's a bit of a uh, fail. A little bit of a fail to me. So I think yellow, purple. Ready? They're no good. Right, we're gonna have a look at next. Which one? The blue one. Now that looks more promising, doesn't it? Here you go. You get those, and I'll get the, um, the close cam. Oh. These ones are a lot better. So, and yeah, if we have a look inside here, look, we've got there's one there. It's like a sort of cuboid shape, and there's another one, that another sort of square, crystally one. And you're going to go at picking up some of these bits, so we can have a look at them. Aren't you? There's all sorts of little crystals that have grown in here. <laughs> Can't pick it up. Yeah. Oh, I don't want to break it, which I did. Have a look at what you've got here then. So, in a minute, you've got you've got a right mixture of um, crystals there, haven't you? Let's have a look. Yeah, we've got a few on the table. What have you got on top of here, look? Hmm. Some other little crystals. Some you? little ones. Let's have a close up of this one and see how close it gets. We've got another yeah, one look. which is absolutely brilliant. It's a bit better than this one, isn't it? So it's, it's grown some crystals, hasn't it? Know, better than the first two. That one But they're not as good as those geodes we got, are they? No. I said that they did take, I think they're thousands of years for those to grow, not a week. So these grow relatively quickly, don't they, compared? Right, so we bring in the good one which is a red one we did. It's still got a bit of fluid left in the bottle. It hasn't fully evaporated, has it? But that's not a problem. Let's see what we've got in here. Right, these might, this might get a bit messy, so do you want to give me the tweezers? Because it's going to be... I wanted to get but one. It's all big one thing, but I don't want you to get all the red liquid dripping everywhere. So go on, put that one in there then. That's it. Let's have a look at what we've got here then. We've got all sorts of different shaped crystals here, haven't we? What have you got there? Look. So there's all sorts of different shapes here. There's like, what are these ones? Rhomboid or they're sort of like long, thin, definitely long, thin, crystally shaped ones, aren't they? Look at that. This one's my favourite. That big one. 
There's some more in there. Yeah, all right, there's all sorts of shapes and things. So I'll have a, a close-up and then I'll put it near the camera so I can... So yeah, look, there's these sort of crystals that are formed into different shapes. So they've all sort of grown, haven't they, from... Um, from the chemicals we mix together and then you put another bit of crystal in and all these well, there's some sort of from it. Well they're the original stones that we put in. We can get the camera to focus. This I think one's this, the biggest out of the, re out of the red ones. Yeah but this is one of the ones that's it's got the sort of most interesting shape really <coughs> isn't it? Look, this okay. one. Oh, this one. That one. Yeah that's just a lot of them stuck together I think. Yeah, so, so this one's sort of in. interesting. Have it. There you go, let's put that I just got this one then. And then it just turned white. Yes. We'll cover then it turned white. Look, it's got what it's gone white. Yeah, it's because there's a red liquid on it and as soon as the red liquid comes off it looks clear. So if you've had one of these kits and you've had any better success with us at growing some of these crystals, let us know. They're a bit, we've not seen them before, so the chances of you finding one are quite good. But you may have grown some crystals similar to this, won't they? I'm sure all of our views out there sort of go. If you have, send us some pictures and we'll put them up and see what they look like. So, if you'd like to like, comment and subscribe, it would be... Greatly appreciated. And until we see you next time for Wacky Wednesday, we will say... Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Hello, welcome to another episode of Golf. Sorry, did you go to Spatel Longfall? Yeah! <laughs>